What functional groups do you see? Aromatic. Aromatic or an arene. I'd accept uh, either of those terms. And? And an amine. So you can have molecules that have multiple functional groups, and that's totally fine. <coughs> okay, let's try this one. I'm going to be careful not to reveal the answer here. I uh, should see four. Okay, what are those? Those are all amines. These are some funky ones. Remember that amine uh, are smelly. This is putrescine. Uh, this is cadaverine, from cadaver, this from putrid. Spermidine and spermine. You can figure out where those are from. <laughs> Let's try this one. Yeah. Not really what kind of functional group is that one? It's, you shouldn't name this a mean. A mind, M A M I D E. So you should a carbonyl next to a nitrogen is called an amide or amid. Okay, this is a a cool one. It's called diarrhea. Half of it is urea, so it's diarrhea. Let's try this next one. This one, uh, you have to look at time closely here. Well. There we go. What do you see? You should see a carboxylic acid up here in the upper left-hand corner. This is alcohol. And what would you call this stuff in here? What's that? That's an ester. An ester. You have a carbonyl next to an oxygen. And it's not an OH like the carboxylic acid. It's an OR. So that's an ester and... <coughs> An alkene. There's an alkene sitting right there. This one, <coughs> constipatic acid. You can imagine the applications of these. Okay, let's try this one. This one's a simple one. What's that? That's an aldehyde. How do you pronounce this? It is not but anal. It is butanal. Butanal. Okay, uh, let's try this one. Okay, I'll be careful not to reveal the answer here. What do you see here? I see two. Uh, not aromatic, nor alcohol. Yeah, a phenol, a phenol. See, whenever you have an aromatic connected to an OH, that's a phenol. So you don't say arene or aromatic or alcohol, you'd say phenol. And, not an ester, ether. When you have an oxygen and two organics on either side, that's an ether. This one is perotitina. Does anybody know what that means? I think it means small-breasted dog. <laughs> okay. What's this one? Phenol and alkene. Yeah. This is anal. And the last one. By the way, M-E, I have to draw it in a little bit because it's a little dark, uh, a little light. M-E means methyl. So M-E, when you see here, is CH3. Sometimes they'll even say C-E-T to mean ethyl. But here, all the M-E's are methyls. What do you see? You should see an arene or an aromatic right here. What's, what are these? Those are ethers. So you see an oxygen with R groups on either side, all three of these. 
got an alcohol, and yeah, you got some alkenes here. Uh, what's this? That, that's also an ether. So you got oxygen with uh, R groups on either side. And what's that? Go right there. That's a ketone. So you got a carbonyl, and on both sides are R groups. Okay? This one's megaphone. <laughs>